25. Psalm 37 at verse number 25. Psalm 37, verse number 25. Amen. If you have it, say amen. If not, say wait. We'll wait. I see some of you still thumbing. Psalm 37 at verse number 25. I've never seen the righteous forsaken, <clears throat> nor his seed begging for bread. Look at your neighbor and say, I've never seen it. <clears throat> Come on, look at another neighbor and say, I've really never seen it. Look at him and say, I've never seen the righteous forsaken nor his seed begging for bread you may be seated you may be seated you may be seated you may be seated <clears throat> brothers and sisters brothers and sisters brothers and sisters we live in a time we live in a season uh, where folk are really uh, 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 going around worrying stressing struggling and straining about where the next meal is coming from <laughs> Uh, the reality of it is, brothers and sisters, is that you cannot uh, allow what you see to supersede what God has already said. <clears throat> Most of us, if not uh, many of us, uh, have come to that place in our, our Christian journey where we have been faced with certain situations and certain strains that have caused us to really not be able to see the hand of God because of what we're going through. And oftentimes the process of through can be uh, very, very stressful. The process of through can cause tears to flow from our face. The process of through can cause us to have some sleepless nights. The process of through can cause us to lose our appetite. The process of through can oftentimes cause us not to want to come to church to just isolate ourselves at our home and insulate ourselves in our own spirit. Have you ever been to that point in your life where you just want to shut the door from society you don't want to talk to nobody you don't want nobody to call you you don't want nobody to ring your phone you ain't trying to hear no sermon you're not trying to read your bible you ain't trying to read a get quick come on help me huh? you ain't trying to read a book the only thing you want to do is just throw your own pity party and God is saying in this season this ain't the time for you to throw up your hands and throw a pity party this is the time for you to throw a praise party as a matter of fact you can praise God even in quarantine is there anybody in the building who can testify I'm at home but I can still praise God Watch this, 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 watch this. So regardless of wherever you find yourself, regardless, uh, regardless of whatever state you find yourself in, God is saying, I'm still worthy. And David says at the top of chapter, at, at the top of Psalm 37, he says, fret not thyself. Y'all missed it, y'all missed it, y'all missed it. He says, fret not thyself because of evil folk because of evil doers come on are you in here now that word fret in the original language simply means to run hot in my own sanctified imagination I had a dodge if you will and I was on my way from Bible study one night when I was pastoring in the country and I was on my way on 59 headed home are you in here I had a dodge magnum I had a dodge magnum it had, it had 24 inch rims on it. it was dodge magnum and I was on my way from Bible study on my way home and all of a sudden I had to pull over because the engine got hot y'all missed that I said the engine got hot and so my next move was to pull over pull up the hood and once I pulled over pulled up the hood there was all there was a whole lot of smoke that came from the hood that was indicative that you couldn't go any further come here come here come here come here there's some folk in the building you can't get what God has for you because you too hot under the hood look at your neighbor and say neighbor this ain't the time to get side ways with folk this ain't the time to get indifferent with folk this ain't the time to get too hot ah, so he says fret 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 not fret not fret not don't worry about what they doing in the White House just make sure God is in your house Hell may be in the White House, but the Holy Ghost should be in your house. Do I have anybody in the building who can testify? 
said, I still have the Holy Ghost. Yeah, yeah. So, so he says, fret not thyself because of evildoers, for they shall soon, they shall soon, look at your name, say soon. Now that word soon will put a timetable on us, but we don't know when God is going to deliver on the soon. Y'all miss that. Our soon is not God's soon, but whenever God delivers on his soon, it's soon enough for us because God's time is always perfect. Look at your neighbor and say, he may not come when you want him to, but every time you call him, he's always there. So God don't have to take a sailboat to get to you. He don't have to take a car to get to you. He don't have to take a plane to get to you. He's there. All of the time. And so David says, David says, David says, fret not, don't get, don't get messed up, don't get sidetracked, don't pull over, don't give up on God, don't hang your hat, because it seems like rich folk who are ungodly are prospering better or more than church folk who profess to be Christians. Boy, y'all show sure miss that. Did y'all hear what I just said? Church folk who profess to be Christians. Remember what I just said is that this this pandemic is revealing the church folk from the Christians. Folk who understand that the pandemic should not cease from causing a spiritual pandemonium in the place of power. Oh! Here it is, here it is, here it is, here it is. The pandemic will cause folk on the outside to lose their hope. But the pandemic on the outside will cause those of us who on the inside a renewed strength. Lord have mercy. Listen, here it is. It's all about perspective. And most of us choose to look at things how we decipher, how we choose to look at them. And most of us in here, and I pray that I'm talking to most of us in here, you've decided to trust God because man has let you down too much. Okay, 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 okay. They do press conferences, uh, and Donald Trump don't know what to say. He don't know how to look. As a matter of fact, Ben Carson went to sleep yesterday. While Donald Trump was, come on, help me in here, huh? Huh? Uh, 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 the medical doctor, the chief medical doctor over the pandemic uh, had to put his head down, put his hands in his face uh, because the president don't know what, come on, help me in here. So when you don't get you, when you can't get no direction from the White House, uh, you can always turn to God's word and say, God, be a fence around me every day. So now you don't get mad, you don't get upset, you don't get angry, you trust God. And David says, don't you run too hot because of evildoers. And don't you become envious of the workers of iniquity because they shall soon be cut off. Uh, so David moves from trusting in one through three and he talks about delighting. Verse four through six. Delight. Ooh, thyself. In who? Ah. Now, the only way you can delight yourself in the Lord is that you have to trust in the Lord. Okay, Proverbs chapter uh, 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 3, 4, 5, and 6. Trust in the Lord with all your who? And lean not to your own understanding. And so if I'm trusting in the Lord, then my trust in man ceases. Because man cannot deliver on anything outside of what, come on, help me in here. Listen, somewhere you have to come to a resolve that you're going to trust God even when you can't trace him. I can't see it, but I'm going to trust you. 
And every once in a while, if I trust you long enough, I'll be able to feel your spirit. Come on, help me. Huh? I'll, be, I, I'll be able to feel the Holy Ghost uh, whisper down into the deep corridors of my spirit. Uh, and the Holy Spirit will rock me in the cradle of his arms and let me know that everything is well. Uh, it might not feel well, but it's still well. Uh, might not sound well, but it's still well. Uh, might not smell well, but it's still well. And we know that all things work together for good. And so, 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 watch this. I got to get out of here. I got to get out. I got to get out. So, 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 so the psalmist in verse number 25, verse number 25 comes and he says, listen, I need to add a personal, uh, uh, personal preference, if you will, of, of witness right here in verse number 25. He says, uh, in verse number one, fret not. Do I have to fret? But I can delight in the 